Hello, how are you everyone? This is Abdul Kafi Hamdu from the eastern part of Aleppo, from the left part of the eastern part of Aleppo. Now it's raining, bumps a little bit calmer. The acid militias are maybe 300 meters away. No place now to go. It's the last place. I hope uh, we can speak again to Periscope, to you again. I think we shared many moments in inside Aleppo. Really, I don't know what to say, but I hope. Uh, I really, I, I have. I hope you can do something for Aleppo people, for my daughter, for the other children. I don't know really what to say. It's words can't go out now. I hope you can do something to stop the expected massacres. Just yesterday, my the next door exactly, all the building coll collapsed. Many people were killed. Uh, many people now are, are being killed and just kept in, in the streets and their buildings. No one can help them. No way, no hospitals, no cure, no... <sighs> to everyone who can hear me, we are here exposed to a genocide in the besieged city of Aleppo. This may be my last video. More than 50,000 of civilians who reveled against the dictator Al-Assad are threatened with field executions or dying under bombing. According to activists, more than 180 people have been field executed in the areas that regime have recently took control on by Assad gangs and the militias that support them. The civilians are stuck in a very small area that doesn't exceed 2 square kilometers, with no safe zone, no life. Every bomb is a new massacre. Save Aleppo, save humanity. We may not be able to send any more messages as regime forces push closer and closer. Uh, the airstrikes become more intense, if there's even such a thing as that. And um, so this might be uh, close to, if not the last communication. Um, if that is the case, I did want everybody to know uh, us at uh, OGN, we really, really appreciate all of the support and the effort that people have given us. If we're able to continue that, then we're going to be doing that.